Jules Ureke, Moldova. And his Ladies trainer and is the one and only Stefan Kurlik. And that is the Belinci. His personal record, four wins, two losses. Fighter representing Scorpion Siyashi Jim, Romania, Maxim Pleshko. So from Romania Scorpions. Fighting for the red corner. 24 years old, of China Constantine Mihai. His personal record, one fight. Fighter representing Thai boxing gym, Moldova, Yon Ureke. One fight, one win. KOK rules, three rounds, three minutes each. And his opponent, 26 years of age. Stands at one meter, eighty centimeters, seventy-seven kilograms as well. Coming in with six fights, four wins, two losses. So a little bit more experience, but a lot of these fighters having come from an amazing and a wealth of amateur fights. So here we go, Romania, Maxim Apleshko in the blue corner, the red, white, and black shorts. In the red corner with blue and gold. Red gloves, Jan Ureshi. Both fighters at the moment in orthodox stance. That's left guard. Oh, big heavy shots coming in there from Jan. Oh, solid shot. Drops him down to his anklets there. Stop, stop, stop. Oh, Well, poor fight is going toe to toe. Little bit warning there, the clinch. Julian Sullivan, spinning up kick, confidently comes from the man from Moldova, Jan Juricci. Remember, scheduled for three three-minute rounds. Big low kick, two low kicks coming in. Well taken on the thigh. No blocking tie style with the shin at the moment. Moves it away this time. Obviously felt a little bit of that solid kicking. Good little round knee there to the body as well. Ion. So Maxim in the moment. Coming off most of countering. Moves back well, but doesn't counter there. That's a good moment to attack when you make your opponent, as I was saying in my gym at Bolton Tie Boxing Club, is make them miss, make them pay. Oh, and a nice spinning back fist. Catching Maxim off balance as well. Not enough for a knockdown, but nice little shot all the same. So, coming into the last 30 seconds of round one in our second of our prelim fights tonight. Ooh, spinning back fist, moved away nicely from Maxim Pleshko. This time he blocks it on the shin, tie style. Ooh, eats a right, but comes back with a nice little combination, the Romanian. Oh, and he's coming out, he's unloading now. Some, oh, some solid punches and he catches him. Four, One five, of those had to get through six, and it did. Taking the man seven, from Moldova down eight, for an eight right. count. This is a good round. Pulls it back because he was losing that round. Right, just in the last final 10 seconds. For me, that would have been a 10-9 round to red, but it's gone 10-8 to blue now. So Romania having lost the first fight, coming back to try and get a win in the second fight of our four prelim fights here in Moldova. We see some of the replays here of some of the action in this first round. Solid shots. 
And it's there, left up, right straight, down the middle. Sends his man down, rocks him to his ankles, the boys. That was the shot. The money shot, down he goes, bish, bosh, bash, down, crash, here in Moldova. One night, one ring, one champion, as they say. The King of Kings slogan. So, red corner. Second round. Behind now as they come into round two. Round. Hopefully that minute has got him recovered. He's come out fast out the stocks. Looks like he's recovered well from that shot. Looks fired up. He does. Look at that. Trying to get that back. Goes with a spinning back fist. But the man right above where I'm sat here. Morning there. The forearm or the elbow is the only thing when you only step round with the spinning back fist. And you don't step across the angle. A lot of people make that mistake. Oh, and he comes back here now. Fantastic. Look at this. There's a real rally going on here in Moldova. Oh, and he spins around the back fist, just clipping the top of the head. Desperate times. The man to try to pull this round back, but both fighters meet their own match. And we've only had 45 seconds, but we've seen almost three minutes of action just in that 45 seconds. Just a slip. Well, both fighters out to get the job done early. This is incredible stuff. Wow. Oh, and again, a big hook comes in, right hand from Maxim Pleshko out to get evens against the first. Oh, nice right straight from Ion. Both guys want this, you can see. A real test. Fantastic matchup here at King of Kings in Moldova at the Manaj Sports Arena. Stop, King stop. of Kings and Eagles in association with FEA, Fighting Entertainment Association. So coming up to the last minute. Of round two. Looping right hand just out of range as Maxim steps away from the power of that punch. Using good distant distance judgment. DJ shakes his hands. Obviously now the lactic acid building up in the muscles. Again, they meet in the middle and go toe to toe. 45 seconds left in round two. Stop, stop. First push. Referee making sure they listen to the referee's command at all times. Julian giving them the they've had to uh, they have a deep they have a briefing and a debriefing. They must know and understand. Oh, and he catches him nicely there as he spun back round. 20 seconds remaining, round two. Ten seconds gone down. Here we go. Final few seconds. So, a pretty even round. <laughs> for me, I'm going to go possibly 10-10 with that round. But for the moment, leading the field, the man in the blue corner. Read the body language there, he looks very tired and he's took a lot of shots from that. Well, he took a big shot, should I say, in round one. He had some comebacks in this second round. In fact, you could almost, well, when I say 10-10, it's possible. You could go 10-9 to blue again, but I'm going to be, I'm going to be nice. I'm going to sit on the fence, as they say. And here we see the action of that second round. Well, one minute's rest in between rounds for these guys to get some water and do what they do best. Bam, bam, bam! Let's go for round three. Step back. Final round. Here we go, final round. Spinning back fist again. Out of range, almost in desperation. Needs to keep to the bread and butter, the basics, which tend to win a lot of fights. Oh, 
again, the spinning back fist just not finding its mark. I think he's done that too many times, and obviously, Maxime Pleshko has got a measure of that. Oh, good body shot and a front kick on the end of that, though, from Ion Orecci. Oh, comes back with some solid shots. Maxim digs deep. Tries to keep the pressure on. Good combinations, ball fighters again pushing through here. So coming into the second half of round three. What's been a really good matchup, Ion Gorecci, the man with lesser professional experience, only having his, having his second pro fight. Maxim coming out with six fights, four wins, two losses. In the previous fights, obviously, Moldova got the nod. A win to Moldova over Romania. Romania being the neighbouring country to here. Again, that spinning back fist. That's nearly done the business a couple of times, but for the most part, has been out of range. So coming up to the last minute of round three. Both fighters having Fair share of this third round. Solid shots now in the red corner. Both fighting well there, but countering well to the Romanian. 30 seconds left. Going for that spinning back fist again. You can see that a mile away. Needs to change those tactics. Either spin the other way or uh, change it. Ten second hammer goes down. Last few seconds now. Could be one of those fights that could go to a draw or possibly blue corner. Depends how the judges have seen this. Well, we had a 10-8 in round one. We had a 10-9 or possibly 10-10 round two. Blue corner's got his hands in the air. He thinks he's got it. I think he's got it. Ladies and gentlemen, Richis Kosmenkis RMC with the announcement. After three rounds, by points, the winner, the winner is, is Blue Corner, yeah. Maxim, Maxim Lesko, yeah. Romania. Yeah, I agree. Definitely the right decision because of that 10 8 round. I think that's what swung everything round and changed the course of this history of this fight. So it goes.